Welcome back guys. Do I dare say to episode 10 of the journey of Elena. Now last week I mean I think we all know what went down last week and it was just definitely mentally emotionally tormenting. I did not see that episode coming at all. I mean I guess I jinxed my own self because I was talking about how like the adventures have become so like derpy and wholesome and random and yeah but no no yeah last week happened. I mean I think you guys can just see my reactions to that to know exactly how I felt about that so we won't dive back into to that but this week I also don't know what they're going to throw at us. I do feel like they are going to give us you know a bit of an emotional break and it is going to go back to kind of a regular lightheartedness but who honestly knows? Honestly I think that is the biggest thing I can comfortably say about the journey of Elena is that we honestly don't know what in the world they're going to throw at us so I guess without further ado let us just jump into things. And if you guys want to watch full anime make sure to check out the link above or else we'll be starting the video in three, two, one, go. Okay, as long as there's no warning sign, like last week, we should be in the clear. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're back. Ooh. Town of Freedom. Okay, easy enough. Easy enough. Have you? <laughs> I, I feel like everyone's glare was a bit like me and like, really? <laughs> Damn. I'm curious as to what's in the box now. I do find out- I didn't expect Aya to kind of be like... A main part of our cast? <laughs> okay, I, I think you guys can just hear the like, wariness in my voice because it, I think that's just what the journey of Elena has done to me. You know, I go into these episodes like, whoop dee doop dee doo and then it's just like, nope, nope, no. Nope. Kind of, I'm kind of on edge now, definitely, definitely, I think. Um, after last week's episode, even after like episode like three and four, I was a little bit worried, but then we had so many like fun episodes during it that it kind of did let down my guard and then they did kind of throw episode nine at us. But anyways, regardless, this week's episode, it looks like we are focusing back on Saya. Uh, I love how I called her Aya. <laughs> Saya, it's Saya, isn't it? Yeah, it is Saya. Uh, but it'll be, yeah, it'll be nice to see if Saya kind of meets up with Elena. I generally did not expect to see Saya as much as I thought. Oh, I, th I thought um, actually Elena was going to kind of join up her journeys with Saya, but it makes sense that they can't do that because, you know, Elena is a traveler and Saya is um, working for the Magic Association. So, their kind of like um schedules uh don't kind of align but we also have this uh don't quite catch her name but like i'll just refer to her as sensei kind of yeah yeah because she's Saya sensei um it looks like we might also focus her on her kind of vacation who knows or it might honestly be an episode without elena and focusing on Saya and her overcoming the temptations to not open that box because i want to know what's in that box I would, I would fail. I would open it. The two teachers. Oh, is this going to be maybe like Sai's teacher and then, yeah, Elena's teacher? I don't know you guys knew each other. Time sure does fly by. Mm. Are you guys going on vacation together? I love this elevator music. <laughs> Goodbye. Ooh. Ooh. I like that one. <laughs> I want that one. <laughs> Damn, cruising style much?
It's a small world sometimes. She was jelly. This is nice. Every year, so you guys do have quite the history. Ooh, savage. <laughs> Sheila, that was her name. Nice. Oh, it's Elena. No, it's it's Nikki, isn't it? She's she has to be Elena's mom. Oh, poor friend sensei. Well, no, she's just friend now, isn't she? In this timeline. Oh, her other princess must have been Sheila. Yeah, yeah, that's her voice. I do like how every witch has a little bit of a different hat going on. That's something I'm appreciating. You were a little scary back then. <gasps> okay, I can see why both of you guys didn't like each other at the start. So it was a little rough around the edges. <laughs> Come on, girls. I love how cute and kind of like shy friend sensei is. Friend is compared to like, you know, friend sensei now is like, well, bam, I'm just saying. <laughs> Let's get along. Rude. Rude, 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 rude. Damn, how? She had the swagalicious right from the start. Yeah. Fish, meat. Yeah. Be for me, please. It's always got to be me. <gasps> Why don't we go with me in the middle? I have bright the idea. Yeah, that works. That works. I feel like we're gonna not accomplish much <laughs> if we're always meeting in the middle. Okay, nice work. Yep, nice. Nice is good. Good, good equivalent. Ooh. Ooh. In a sexy way. Answer, answer, answers to everything, you know? How do you draw your wand in a sexy way? <laughs> Is this the land, the kingdom of freedom? I had the same kind of like layout as the map, so I was just wondering. It is a town of freedom. 
I love how her broom even sparkles. Oh, they're not the biggest fan of witches in this town. Surprising, a country where witches are not welcome. Don't worry, you guys become best friend. The job is... <laughs> Gotta always worry about the doge first. No, no, that's right. Just tell me the doge first. Ten gold? Ten? I don't know how much that is, but okay, it looks like it's a big amount. Okay, okay. Oh, they're the ones doing that. Can we get a replacement wand or? I love how she just casually keeps smoking inside. Oh, that must neutralize the magic, I feel. Oh no, it's in oh no, a lot of things. Invisibility cloak, a gun that can shoot hundreds of bullets. Matches that show visions of mythical beast. Where did they acquire all this? Yeah, I didn't know tools like that existed. Interesting. Ah, oh, that's why. So it's not a hatred, it's more just like a... They think they can't do much. <laughs> no? My two apprentices? Hey? I mean, yeah, of course, not a problem for the apprentices of Nikki. <gasps> oh, oh, that's a bit. It looks like they're not phrased by challenge accepted. Oh, okay. No, no, no. It was more like I'll get hurt. So. <laughs> oh, okay. I guess I was, I was, I would have lost in that fight. I was a bit too naive. you go Ooh. no that's not fair back off I use you to corner him jeez I can't deal with people like that Is he not getting away right now? Oh, look, where did he go? Yeah, no, I'm on Fran's side with this one. That wasn't, that wasn't cool. Oh, she turned into butterflies because, you know, Fran said so he likes butterflies. You're going to end up both being expelled if you don't get your shit together. Look at the t 
teddy bear. Did you guys see the little teddy bear cookies? They look divine. Who are you? Dodgy is... Is that not her? In the... Friend you, of course she knew. She can't be that oblivious. You actually have come. Oh, she, the leader. Oh, this whole place is. Oh, ox me goats. Oh, even you are a part of this. I think she got herself into a bigger mess. She used it as a motherfucking back scratcher. Oh, and look who's also tied up along with you. Because you guys thought there was an eye in teamwork. Are you guys really going to do this in the middle? The box was there. So the box is in relation to this. <laughs> what did she whisper? What did she whisper? The knife, the knife, pull it out in a sexy way. Sweetie, and this is why you learn fist fighting and knife work. Sexy time. <laughs> ten out of ten sexiness. Oh, nice. Oh, <laughs> you've learned well. You've learned well. That's right, these aren't no ordinary witches. Ooh. Look at you girls go. Nice. Take the wand. I should just like, just gotta light, just gotta light my Siggy. Give me a moment. Just gotta take a moment. Any time now. <laughs> Doesn't matter if you have a hundred bullets. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, I'm sorry, ladies. You got caught on purpose. We'll, we'll, we'll say it was all on purpose. The box, see? The box. 
Now, if that wasn't fabulous and absolute boss, I don't know what was. A thing we can finally agree on. <gasps> oh. Picked on the wrong person. There's no one to tell you. You were just a lonely kitty. What about you, friend? Are we the only one in the country? Nice. I mean, First, first witch of the the country. That sounds pretty nice. Looks like you guys had a lot more in common than you thought. Oh, this is aesthetically stunning. This is beautiful. That's, oh, I wish we explored a bit more of the town. <gasps> and she returned. That that's that's the house. Yeah, this is the house. Yeah, hundred percent confirmed. I mean, I think it was already confirmed, but congratulations! They look great on you guys. Which title? So the Kuro Stardust Witch. The Night Witch. I like, yeah, I like how she. Set each other off so each looks its best. That makes sense. That's quite beautiful. <laughs> we'll always be yeah 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 we'll still we'll always be like you know together that was cute pal and that's how the naming of witches based on their hair color started because elena is the um Ashen, which wasn't she? Yeah, I'd, I'd say this is a lot more peaceful. <laughs> Yeah, are you? Oh, why, 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 why? What's in the box? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought, I thought she knew, but she didn't. It just clicked. So she wasn't aware. The Town of Freedom. In the volume four of my favorite book, The Adventure of Mickey. Uh huh. She's here, heading to the... 
the town of freedom. Everyone's going to meet up at the town of freedom for one maybe banger of a finale. Who knows? I'd expect all these pathways to end up all like interwining with each other. So it looks like Elena is currently at the Town of Freedom. We know that Saya is currently heading to the Town of Freedom as well to return the box. And we just had this flashback of Fran Sensei as well as Sheila Sensei at the Town of Freedom and obviously Nikki's adventure there. So interesting. I feel like this is the storyline we're going to end up exploring for like the last kind of two episodes, like the arc that's going to wrap up the series. Obviously, I'm not too sure, but it looks like there might be more of a story to tell at the Town of Freedom concern. We did leave off with that kind of head leader saying like, oh, I'll get back at you guys. So like, and saying that the senseis are also both heading there as well. This is, I feel like a fun kind of event is going to go down, especially because of what exactly is in the box. I'm going to take a guess and say that the box has to be what led to maybe those mysterious items, you know, those magical items that could shoot a hundred bullets, could cut through anything in that little invisibility clip. I feel like the box might be the item that led to all of these events who knows i mean i was super curious as to what exactly was in the box but obviously um she doesn't say knows because she had that flashback she was like oh, and she panicked and that's why she suddenly decided to like change her course of her vacation and chase after size so she knows what's in that box and it has to be something pretty big for her to you know like stop her vacation this was definitely a nice kind of like break of an episode where everything was quite wholesome i think it was nice kind of learning more about you know our senseis getting to know more about those kind of two characters Characters, as I do feel like they both kind of played an important role towards like Elena as well as Saya like you know they were quite influential kind of like Sensei so I think it was nice having that background story as well as learning about finally Nikki and finally seeing like you know her full face and we can 100% I think 1000% confirm now that it is Elena's mom because we also saw the little cottage and um, when they said that they returned home and she was giving them their like kind of witch badge that was the exact same kind of like house design that we saw Elena leave um in the first kind of episode so we 100% know that Nikki is is now Elena's mom which I'm pretty sure we all already knew considering like you know how similar they both look but yeah it was a nice kind of touch I think going back to the past I think it was a good kind of like break from last week's episode <laughs> let's move on from that but yeah it was kind of like a nice break completely different vibe to it whilst also kind of getting to learn more and it does look like it might lead to quite the exciting kind of season finale wrap up who knows I am kind of curious to see considering we are going to last two couple of episodes if this arc like the story that they have kind of started us off with in the time of freedom will lead to kind of like the conclusion of the series who knows but that does get me very excited so i guess until next time make sure you guys stay awesome and i'll catch you guys then